Chicago religious leaders speaking out and putting pressure on Mayor Lori Lightfoot over the Chicago police wrong home raid. And WGN's Jenna Barnes is joining us now live with the very latest tonight. Jenna? Ray and Micah, this group of pastors met with us after they met with Mayor Lori Lightfoot virtually this afternoon. They're calling for accountability for CPD, COPA, and the mayor's office because of the treatment of Anjanette Young and how her case has been handled in the nearly two years since the wrong raid. These faith leaders allege this has amounted to an attempted cover-up. The city sought sanctions against Miss Young's lawyer for releasing the body camera video, but Mayor Lightfoot announced today it has withdrawn that request. The mayor is also calling the city's legal effort to prevent CBS2 from first airing the video this week a mistake. After CBS aired that video, the mayor said she hadn't been made aware of this case, but she walked that back yesterday, saying her team had flagged emails for her about this a year ago. Police Superintendent David Brown told us in the wake of this case, just this month, CPD has made changes to its no-knock warrant process. He says no-knock warrants can now only be approved by a high-level bureau chief and only if there's danger to life and safety. But this group of faith leaders says that is not enough change. COPA has failed. It's an, a failed experiment and black and brown people have paid the price. We want equal justice under the law. We want no more delays, no more apologies, no more excuses. We need change right now. They're also calling for a full city council investigation. We've learned the city council will meet for a special meeting Tuesday to vote on an order that would begin negotiations for a settlement in this case and for Miss Young immediately. Reporting live from CPD headquarters, I'm Jenna Barnes, WGN News. Thank you, Jenna.